so what you want to look for is those tags right there see it says markdown for resale and there's lots of flies and stuff because it's hot but that's what you want to look for for merchandise bags is they will write everything off on that ticket and put that ticket into the bag so just be aware of that and we'll pull that out and see if there's anything worth having in it and it's kind of heavy and this has been here for a couple days see the maggots yeah we're not pulling that out of there we will leave it but I just wanted to show you that tag so that you know what to look for and that's an empty box so yeah it looks like perfume they marked down all right on to the next okay i know you like to see in the dumpster so i'm going to show you what's in here so far it's one of these pretty broken mirrors that everybody's getting and they just take the mirror out and use the frame i'm going to leave that for the other dumpster divers that i know will pick this clean the last time I came and it was this full when I came back it was way down here to the bottom okay so someone will come and get all this stuff that I don't need and um, don't want to take um, there's a pair of jeans that have some rips and stains um, not a size that even my husband could wear to work in um, there's this little box. It's a book. And then there's puzzle pieces in. And there's a few more way in the back of the dumpster. I saw them. Um, I got one um, that I could reach and get the whole thing. This is a table. An outdoor table. And it's glass on top. I don't know if it's all intact. Um, someone will come and get this. Um, a bunch of these clamps, which I went ahead and got, um, and I put them in my tote. Um, there's a bunch of these bath bombs, so I filled up a bag with them, basically, these bath bombs. There's a shower curtain, there's a little book, um, like puzzles and stuff. And then here's the one of these that I did get that was all intact, has all the puzzle pieces. And then this cushion, which is perfect on one side. And they didn't cut it, but they marked on the other side, and that's fine. I'll either get the marker out or I'll leave it. I don't care. Um, and then at the other store, grocery store, I got some Philadelphia cream cheese, still a little cold. There's some watermelon, three packs of strawberries. And then some of these little mini cucumbers. So I'll see, show you if there's anything else. And if not, that'll be a wrap. Hi guys, it's Tina. Just wanted to give a quick message that what I'm doing isn't just for my family. It's for the other families that I assist and take food to. And it's for the food banks and the women's shelter that I also donate to. So if you believe in my cause and you want to help support me on my mission to save the environment one dumpster at a time, you can donate to the channel simply by buying me a coffee or two. You can find the link down in the description box. It's three dollars US. So buy as many as you want or you can or just, you know, ignore the message if this isn't for you. But a lot of people have expressed interest in just how they can help, and that's a quick way to do it. Have a good day, guys. Okay, here we are in this one. There's a case of diet boba. Looks like some uh, cheese. Some of the cheese that, um, canned cheese. some canned raviolis this is just stinky smelly gra uh, garbage looks like there might be some um, snacks over there Kit Kat and 
something else. I'll have to dig them out and see. So I'll be going to that other side and um, getting my rake. I wish my husband was here. He would climb in and get this stuff for me, but he's not. I'm on my own. So I've got my gloves and I'll see what I can get. Thanks guys. Okay, what I managed to save was an entire case of these Rice Krispie treats. It had spilled out, but I got them all. Um, an entire case of these Frank and Beans, and expires June 3rd, which we know um, canned goods are still good. I think I got two of these uh, beef ravioli. And uh, there were a lot more, but they were at the bottom of the dumpster. Seven, nine, nineteen. One of these little uh, shaker cheeses. A whole bunch of these little Advil uh, two tablets packs. And yep, an entire ham, still cold to the touch. And a bunch of um, honey smoked white turkey meat. There's some bacon I'm not quite sure about. I'll check it when I get home, but um, the ham and the sliced turkey all feels cold. So um, I try to get here, you know, around the time that I know that they're putting stuff out. So that's going to be it for me for tonight. Thank you guys for watching. Please do like the video and subscribe if you haven't already. And have a wonderful day.